How's it going? This is Hoyman and today we're taking a look at the Amiibo Peach figure. So this figure is obviously based on an illustration from Smash Brothers for Wii U and I think for the most part they did a really good job. It captures the lightness of the illustration really well and then the sculpt on the figure is very decent for the most part. And overall it does look like Peach quite a bit. So taking a closer look at the face, I feel that they have done a decent job at Peach's character. It does look a bit off on some angles, but I think for the most part, it does capture the character pretty well. The eyes are very nicely painted on, look very clean for the most part. And then you move on to the hair, which is nicely sculpted for the most part. And it's painted in a nice yellow finish, but then you have darker shades of oranges in some areas to kind of bring out the highlights and kind of adds a bit more depth to the hair. Her earrings are nice metallic blue finish, so they really stand out from the figure. And that's the same for the crown. It's a nice metallic gold with the metallic reds and blues. Moving down to her outfit. It's nicely sculpted for the most part. I do like the fact that the dress is actually a nice metallic pink finish. So it really makes this figure pop. And that's the same for her gloves as well. It's a nice metallic white. And then you have the gold patterns around her blue emblem on the chest. It looks pretty nice. And then down to the skirt. The whole skirt is a softer material which is kind of a nice touch, I suppose. And then the metallic pink continues on to the dress. Same for the metallic whites. And then you have the gold patterns around the whole dress as well, which is really nicely painted on. It's very nice and clean. And I do like the fact that this part of the dress is a brighter pink and it's actually a matte finish. So it makes a nice contrast from the metallic colors and then the gold patterns continues on the rim of the dress as well and then of course the white parts are nicely sculpted with the etching in there too and then for the under the sky itself on the underneath is not sculpted really so it's just a very soft texture in there but you do have her legs in there so it looks pretty nice for the most part. And then the base itself is the Smash logo, reminiscent from the game. And then on the other side, you have legal stuff. So overall, I do feel that this is a pretty good amiibo figure of Peach. Captures the lightness of the illustration really well. And the sculpt for the most part is quite simple, but I feel that it is pretty effective with all the use of the metallic colours. So it really does make this figure stand out and pop a bit more. The few gripes that I have with this figure is that on the back of her hair here, there's a peg that connects the hair to the back. And that kind of breaks the immersion a bit. And I'm not really sure if it was entirely necessary. It's mainly there to kind of support the head. But... Because it's a transparent piece, it isn't as noticeable, but I just thought I'd point it out. And then the skirt itself, there is a bit of a seam line that runs down across it, but it isn't super noticeable, so it's not too bad. And then a the very minor gripe is that the white on the skirt is a bit sloppy on the paintwork, but again, it isn't super noticeable. So for the most part, I don't really have too many gripes with this figure. I think the main gripe that people might have is probably the face. Some might feel that it doesn't quite look like the character. And I do agree in in some ways that from some angles it doesn't quite look like Peach. But I think for the most part they have captured the likeness of the character really well. And if you are a fan of this character or the games then I do still recommend this figure. But that's my review. Thank you for watching and enjoy some pictures.
Thank you.